what is up everybody, I'm Star Lord Dance. Today I'm going to be showing you guys where to find Mimikyu and most importantly, Marshadow in the new Pokemon Brick Bonds Halloween update. Yes, that is right, these two amazing, awesome, most wanted Pokemon are now available in this month's update. And uh, I'm pretty happy to show you guys where they are. As you can see on screen right there, there's that little cute guy right there, Marshadow. He looks so cute. I love him so much. He's actually my favorite legend, uh, well, I guess mythical, from the new generation of Pokemon. It's crazy good. Uh, but anyway, let's get straight into today's guy, guys. So the first thing that we want to do is we're going to have to fly to either or three locations. Now, the first location I'm going to be showing you guys is Port Deca. Now, like I said, guys, there's three locations to find Marshadow. Port Deca is just one of them. So once we're at Port Deca, what we're going to do is go through this little roots extender right here and then carry on onto, um, I think it's called Cosmos Valley, I think. Yes, it is. So there you go. We're on Cosmos Valley right now. And what we're going to do is get on our hoverboard and just go behind this big, huge kind of mountain structure here on our right. And pretty much here in this open field right behind these two trees just in this area right here you will find that a huge teleport or a huge kind of black hole will spawn there of a night time because obviously it's Halloweeny it has to be of a night and because more shadow is a shadow type Pokemon or you know kind of dark ghost type whatever it has to be at night guys now the next location I'm going to show you to need you to go and travel to Rose Cove City once you're at Rose Cove City guys we're going to go and head down this way that I'm going right now right through this route extender and on to the next route now I'm not 100% sure what this route is it is route 9 there you go and what I'm going to do is put on a max repel because I know I'm going to go past a couple of uh, grass patches on the way we're going to turn left at the big huge white tree onto the windmill route that's probably what you guys know this next route as everyone just calls it the windmill route it's never like a number it's always like the route with the windmill uh, and once we're here guys what we're going to do is go towards the windmill and go up this little ramp right here. And somewhere around about here should be where the portal spawns. So it could either be at Port Deca Cosmos Valley or it can be here. And I'm going to show you the very last location right now. So that's where we have to go to Aradia City. So let's just fly there right now. And once we're here, what we're going to do is head down this way to our left. And uh, this is going to be where we need to go to the next route. The next route, uh, which is like the kind of deserty place that kind of goes to Moo Moo Farm. You know, the milk tank farm kind of thing. So that's where we're going to go. We're going to keep on going up here. Again, I'm going to use another repel because there's so many grass patches. I kind of didn't want to um interrupt this tutorial. Uh, but anyway, as we get through here, you should see this uh, kind of tree in this little area right here. And this is where... The the third portal can spawn of a nighttime, guys. So remember to always check these three locations once it hits nighttime. And uh, as you can see right here, I waited a little while and there is the portal. It actually popped up right here. I didn't have to go anywhere for it. It was automatically just here. So I was pretty happy about that. And uh, what this is, is it's a actual portal to the Shadow Realm in which Mars Shadow lays there. And uh, if we just step on it, it'll kind of put you in the upside down, kind of like Stranger Things. If any of you guys have ever seen that awesome series, it's a little bit like that. Uh, but once we're here, what we're going to do is continue going down this little uh, this little lane kind of type area, I guess. And uh, if you just kind of pay attention to the back of my character on the floor, you should see Mars Shadow's kind of figure kind of show up. And if you just kind of stay like that, what we're going to do is we're going to hover over it. You should see the eyes pop up and uh, then you just have to click it and then the awesomest thing happens. It's probably one of the coolest animations ever. It's the simplest, but it's one of the coolest. Mars Shadow arises from his shadow and he then reveals himself to you in which then you are able to battle Mars Shadow and uh, you can actually soft reset for this dude too. That's pretty cool, I thought. Uh, I'm pretty sure you can soft reset too for a shiny Pokemon. Now, a lot of po people are probably thinking, why are you doing that when, you know, why, why are you catching him when you can soft reset for him? Well, basically, I like to catch my Pokemon on my second account, so that's what I'm going to do instead of catching him on this. Uh, but instead, this Mars Shadow with my original gamer tag or, or original trainer name will be in a giveaway sometime in the next day or two so please make sure that you subscribe turn on notifications and do not miss out on that that'll be a really rare Pokemon to have in your inventory on your team so now most of you guys are probably wondering where the heck where the heck 
Mimic is Mimikyu, and uh, yeah, for Mimikyu we need to go to Chesma Town. It is located at the bottom side of the map, and uh, once we get here, you should remember that there was a little forest area back here where we could encounter Pikachus. Now this is very important because what is Mimikyu pretty much mimicking? Yes, a Pikachu, and this is where Pikachus spawn. So basically guys, of a night time, when the sky is dark, you need to come to this forest right here, Gale Forest, and you need to keep on going back and forth, back and forth, until you meet a Pikachu. Now unfortunately, I don't have the clip in this video right now as it's kind of late right now, it's 5 a.m. I'm staying up all night to bring you guys this tutorial. Um, but basically guys, you will find a Mimikyu uh, disguised as a Pikachu. When you actually meet a Pikachu, it'll say, huh, wait, something's wrong with this Pikachu. And then next minute, it will kind of transform into Mimikyu, uh, this revealing itself to be, you know, the Mimic Pokemon. Uh, so yeah, guys, I really hope that you enjoyed today's video and guide. If you did, please remember to leave a like as it does help me out. I really need this at the minute, to be honest. And uh, yeah, I just hope that you guys have a lot of fun with this new Halloween update. And um, be, stu be, be sure, be sure to stay tuned for live streams, giveaways of more Shadow, and uh, all that kind of stuff. So uh, yeah, guys, have a very awesome day, and until next time, I mean Star Lord. Oh, see ya.